Hello everyone, I am Veos, and on the 4th of July, I am going to attempt a very long live stream. Maybe not all day, but definitely a handful of hours. So, with that being said, what am I going to live stream about? Reusable rockets. The cool thing about reusable rockets is that they are here, now. And in the very near future, we could be seeing a fully reusable rocket SSTO. Now, these rocket SSTOs are better known as SSRTs, or Single Staged Rocket Technology. I've been building these SSRTs for a while now in Kerbal Space Program, as well as RSS. But finally, I've been able to make an SSRT that launches like a rocket and lands like a plane. But something possessed me and I didn't stop there. So I went ahead and built an entire ground crew that could not only collect the SSRT, but put a payload in it, refuel it, prop it upright, and launch it again. Now that sounds like a lot of work, and it is. On top of the fact that KSP 1.3 constantly crashes for me. Sometimes it won't crash until about 15-20 minutes into gameplay, and other times it'll be about 45 minutes to an hour. I've done everything I can think of. I've deleted KSP, I've reloaded it, I've taken off all the mods, I've updated the computer systems. Still getting crashes. So come 4th of July, just be aware that KSP will crash multiple times during the live stream. I might even take wagers to see who can guess how many times it crashes during the live stream. Now I know that a lot of you who live in the US are going to be doing things for the 4th of July. So I'm going to try to make this live stream first thing in the morning around 9 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. Now I will be making these craft files available for download a couple hours before the live stream. That way you could go ahead and follow along if you so desire. Now in the live stream we're gonna try to build a space station using all these crafts. Even though it might take a little longer than normal I might not even be able to finish the space station but we'll try to get as much done as possible. And on top of that of course we have KSP and its buggy self exploding things on the runway and whatnot and of course on top of that the game crashes so at least it won't be boring i think well i think i've covered about everything i'm sure i'm forgetting something but uh so don't forget to leave a like and comment below about what you think future ssto's are going to be will large bulky ssto rockets become the norm will the skylon ever come out in our lifetime Again, thank you so much for watching, and thank you so much for being a part of this channel. And I hope to see you all there. I am Veos, signing off, and have a good night.